In the previous session, we had discussed few basic examples to convert finite automata into regular expression using state elimination method. In this session, we will apply state elimination method and we will take few more example to convert the finite automata into regular expression. Let's start the session. So in state elimination method, we will delete state one by one, keeping only starting and final state. We will put the effects of removed state on other state and we will convert the finite automata into generalized finite automata. In generalized finite automata, on a transition from one state to another state, we can have regular expression on the transitions. Suppose we want to convert the given finite automata that is starting with A and ending with B into regular expression. Although we are aware about this one that it can be represented by this regular expression, but we will try to write down its regular expression using state elimination method. Let's suppose Q0 is our starting state, QR is the rejected state and QF is the final state. So in state elimination method, we can directly remove reject or dead state because they are having no effect on the regular expression. So we can remove QR state directly from the finite automata. Now we are left with three state Q0, Q1, QF. Q0 is the starting state and QF is the final state. So we need to remove Q1 state. For removing Q1 state, we can remove edge from QF to Q1 first. So we can remove it by putting its effect on other states. And if we want to put its effect on Q1 state, so we will start with Q1 and we can read B, we will move to QF. Then there is a loop of B on QF and on reading of A, we will come back. So we can consider this one as a self loop of B, B star and A. So B, B star, A. Now we can able to write down its corresponding regular expression by removing Q1 state. So Q0, QF state and A, A plus B, B star A whole star B and there is a self loop of B on QF. So its corresponding regular expression is A, A plus B, B star, A whole star B and B star. So this represents the final regular expression for the given finite automata using state elimination method. You can observe that this is equivalent to the regular expression a into a plus b star b. Now we will consider the case of removing the edge from qf to q1 and putting its effect on qf state. So it is q0 a q1 there is a self loop of a b qf state and there is a self loop of b on qf. Now we want to put effect of removal of this edge on QF state. So we will start with QF state and we can call it as A, A star, B. And we are coming back to QF state. So we can call it as A, A star, B. Now we can easily able to write down its regular expression. That is A, A star, B, and there is a loop of B plus A A star B whole star. So there might possible that we can able to find out more than one regular expression depending upon the order of removal of state as well as removal of edges and putting their effect on different states. Now given the finite automata, we want to convert this finite automata into regular expression. So Q0 is the initial state and Q2 will be the final state. So we need to remove Q1 state. For removing the Q1 state, we need to eliminate 
this edge and we can able to eliminate this edge by putting its effect on q0 or q1 we are putting the removal of this edge on q0 state you can also try for removing of this edge and putting its effect on q1 state now if we want to put its effect on q0 state we can start with q0 state we will read b and on reading of a we will come back to q0 state so we can call it as a loop of ba now we can easily able to remove q1 state because this can be considered as a loop of a comma ba so we can write down a plus ba star on reading of b we will move to q1 state on reading of b we will move to q2 state and there is a self loop of a and b so a plus b star so this represents the final regular expression for the given finite automata given the finite automata we want to convert this finite automata into regular expression so we can remove this edge and we can able to write down its corresponding regular expression so for removing this edge we can put its effect on q0 state or q web state so if we will put its effect on q0 state we will start with q0 state on reading of a we are moving from q0 to qf and there is a self loop of b so a b star and reading of a we will come back so it will be a b star a so we can write down a b star a and earlier there is a self loop of b so we can write down its regular expression as b plus we can replace it by b comma a b star a so whole star then on reading of a we will move from q0 to qf and there is a self loop of b so b star so this will be the corresponding regular expression for the given finite automata now we will consider the other case where we will put its effect on qf state so it is q0 b a q web state so now we will start with q web state and we will read a then b star and a we will come back to q web state so a b star a now we can write down its regular expression as b star there is a self loop of b on q0 then on reading of a we are moving from q0 to qf and there is a self loop of b as well as self loop of a b star a on qf so we can write down b a plus b star a whole star you can check it out whether these regular expression are equivalent or not they are equivalent if they will accept same set of string two regular expression are equivalent if they represent same set of strings thanks for watching this session